What's up guys? So I said I'd make a video on this. Um, I was working on this for a little while, but I wanted to show you guys how I do aluminum business cards. Uh, real quick before I take you over to the machine and show you the cards, I just wanted to show you my light burn settings. So I just did a 3.4 inch by 2.1 inch square. And then I did the grid, uh, the grid pattern. Um, I do about four at a time. For this demonstration, I'm just gonna do the one. So this is my business card. I, I like to give uh, the aluminum business cards out of like craft shows and things like that. Um, I think it just looks a little bit better. So I have my, what I specialize in, my name and contact number, my Facebook page, and then I just put a little promo on the bottom saying all veterans and first responders receive a 10% uh, discount on all orders. So that's pretty much that. I have them saved uh, up here, um, the, front and my, the front and back of my cards. Um, so I can just turn them off, turn back on. This works great. These are the settings I use right now. I use 125 uh, inches a minute, 85% power. I do bi-directional fill. I do 400 lines per inch. It's probably a little overkill. You probably can go down to like 300, 325. Um, and then I do fill all groups together. Uh, I don't really mess with any of the advanced settings on these. I don't do cross hatch. Um, so uh, yeah, that's it. So I'll take you over to my scene, uh, my laser real quick and show you. All right, so this is my Atostack A5. It's a 20 watt laser. Um, I have it set on a, a sheet of granite here. Uh, this granite was used by my grandpa. He did leather making. So I know it's perfectly flat. So I have it set on top of here for now until I can make a more permanent stand. Um, and then it comes with a little focus card. It's kind of like what you set your focus at. And then I use, uh, there's a couple different kinds of business cards. Um, I have the blue, uh, I also have the red, and then obviously my most popular is the black. Um, I buy these in packs of 100. I buy the colors in packs of 50. We run about I think the packs of 50 run about like 13 bucks each. Uh, a pack of 100 runs about about 20 bucks. Um, so just for this demonstration, I'm just gonna do it on a blue card. So I do my grid on here so I know where I'm going. I'm gonna set my card as centered on the grid as I can. I'm also going to put the focus card on top of it, and then I'm gonna move my laser over to it. Now this is an add-on to my laser. Um, this just helps me move it up and down without having to loosen the two carriage bolts, uh, moving it and then tighten them. Uh, I just had this 3D printed for like 20 bucks or something like that. So you're gonna lower this until it rests on top and then I just tighten, tighten this up just a little bit. And then you're gonna remove the focus card. I'm gonna set this card back in there just a little bit. So the, the Z height is set. So anybody that uses a CNC knows that the Z height is the up and down. And then I'm going to go ahead and set my origin. So I know my origin is up. My origin is always in the bottom left corner. Um, sometimes you can set the origin off, off of the board. Uh, for these business cards, I just use the corner of the card. I'm gonna go ahead and fire my laser. And I'm just gonna zero it over in that corner. Close enough. <clears throat> so for this demonstration, I'm just gonna run it real quick. <clears throat> Again, it's 125 inches a minute at 85% power. And this should take roughly about four minutes to do the entire card. So just like that, it's gonna go ahead and engrave it.
right, it's done. <clears throat> I sped it up to 200% just to see how it would look. It still looks pretty good. Uh, it's a little crooked, but if you got that lined up better, it'd be a little bit nicer. Next thing I do is I just take a shop towel and a little bit of acetone and just put a little bit on the shop towel and I will just rub it on here. It takes off all the soot, all the burnt anodized paint. And that is how I get my business cards. This works for um, all of my cards, my CNC cards. So, hope that helps.